Hi friends, welcome to our channel. In this video, we are going to practice multiple choice questions in the lesson Matter Around Us. There are single correct answer questions, single wrong answer questions, multiple correct answer questions, matching type questions, assertion and reasoning questions, and uh, find the odd one out questions all of you observe the question carefully and answer the questions let us see first question single correct answer question observe the image given the image shows ice cubes what is the main characteristic of this uh, state of matter? Particles are far apart and move freely. Particles are close but can move past each other. Particles are tightly packed in a fixed structure. Particles conduct electricity. Which one is correct? These are ice cubes. That means they are in solid state. We know that in a solid particles are tightly packed. It has fixed shape. That's why correct answer is particles are tightly packed in a fixed structure. Let us see next question. Observe the adjacent figure. The substance which changes from solid to gas directly. What is this substance? Carefully observe the image. What is the substance? That is camphor. Camphor is a solid and uh, it uh, changes from solid to gas directly this phenomena is known as sublimation which substance is available in three states do you know that water is available in three states ice water and water vapor or steam so, correct answer is water, which is not a property of solid. Definite shape, definite volume, easily compressible, particles are closely packed. Observe carefully, the question is, which of the following is not a property of solids? That means, we have to observe which is wrong. Here, solids have definite shape, definite volume and particles are closely packed. They are not easily compressible. So, here, wrong one is easily compressible. Next question, which statement is incorrect regarding the states of matter? Solids have fixed positions for their particles. Liquids flow and take the shape of their container. Gases have a fixed shape and volume. Solids have a fixed shape. Here we have to observe which statement is incorrect. Here gases have a fixed shape and volume. This uh, statement is incorrect. That's why the answer is C. Now, multiple correct answers question. Which of the following properties are characteristics of gases? Definite shape, definite volume, high compressibility, ability to flow. 
observe carefully which characteristics of gases are correct ab or bc or cd or da which one c and d are the correct properties of gases let us see another question we have to find the matter which is in liquid state here water and mercury are in liquid state so the answer is c and a that is the correct answer here two correct answers are given in column a solid liquid gas are given column b takes the shape of its container has a definite volume particles are tightly packed has a definite shape and volume expands to fill its container has neither a definite shape nor volume now we have to match items in column a with column within column b so for this purpose we have to know the exact properties of solids liquids and gases observe carefully solids have definite shape and volume so b is correct for solid now observe about liquids they take uh, the shape of its container so a is for second next another one is for gases that's why the answer is 1b 2a 3c in this way we have to match the column a and column b let us see another question match the items in column a with their correct descriptions in column b in column a ice water helium steam are given and their descriptions are given in column b liquid state of h2o solid state of h2o gas state of h2o gas used in balloons less dense than air now we have to match them here ice is solid state of h2o water is liquid state of h2o helium gas is used in balloons less dense than air and the steam is a gas state of h2o so 1b 2a 3d 4c is correct now let us see assertion and reasoning question here assertion solids have a definite shape and volume reason the particles in a solid are closely packed and have fixed positions both a and r are true and r is the correct explanation of a both a and r are true but r is not the correct explanation of a a is true but r is false and the last one a is false but r is true for this purpose we have to observe both the statements first one solids have a definite shape and volume it is correct that means assertion is true and what about the reason the particles in a solid are closely packed and have fixed positions that means this reason is also correct so 
option A is correct answer for this question. Both A and R are true and R is the correct explanation of A. So, in this way, we have to observe carefully and answer the question. Let us see another question. Arrange the states of water in the order they appear when ice is heated from below freezing to above boiling. That means we have to arrange the states of water when we heat an ice cube. Look here. Options are given ice, stream, water, ice, water, steam, steam, water, ice and water, ice, steam. Which one is correct? First uh, ice uh, that is solid and then liquid and then lastly we get steam. So this is the correct order. In this way we have to answer the question. Next, uh, arrange in sequential order. This type of questions, let us see. Arrange the states of matter from the least to the most kinetic energy of particles. Gas, liquid, solid liquid solid gas solid liquid gas solid gas liquid look here kinetic energy of particles means the movement of the particles we have to arrange them from the least to the most that means movement of particles in solid is very less and then after that liquids and then gases so answer is solid liquid and gas in this way we have to arrange the sequential order now let us see observe the options and uh, Identify the odd one. Water, ice, steam, oil. Observe carefully. Water, steam, oil are different from ice. Why? Because ice is solid. Now, let us see another question. Identify the odd one out based on the physical state of at a solid at room temperature so this one is odd among the four thank you for watching see you in the next video if you like the video like share and subscribe and also comment thank you